As the Green Bay Packers wrap up another intense training camp, fans and analysts alike are left with one burning question. Who truly stood out during these grueling weeks? In a month filled with sweat, strategy, and countless drills, certain players not only met expectations but shattered them. From the unwavering resilience of Jordan Love to the explosive reemergence of Tucker Craft, this year's camp has been nothing short of a revelation. But who among them will translate this momentum into the regular season? Will the rising stars maintain their form under the bright lights, or will they falter when it matters most? Today, we delve deep into the six standout players from this year's Packers training camp, exploring their journey, their impact, and what their performance means for the team's future. As we break down the key moments and crucial plays, we invite you to join the discussion. Who do you think will be the game changers this season? Comment below, hit that like button, and don't forget to subscribe for more Packers news. Tucker Craft's journey through this training camp is nothing short of inspiring. Recovering from a torn pectoral, Kraft was sidelined for the first half of camp, leaving many to wonder if he could regain his form. But as soon as he stepped back onto the field, it was clear that Kraft was not just returning. He was coming back stronger than ever. In the final week, Kraft showcased his resilience, making pivotal plays that left coaches and teammates in awe. His performance against the Baltimore Ravens was a statement. Not only did he catch four crucial passes during practice, but he also bulldozed his way into the end zone, turning heads with his raw power and determination. Kraft's presence was felt on every snap, whether he was blocking or running routes. His ability to shake off the rust and immediately contribute at a high level speaks volumes about his work ethic and potential for the upcoming season. Jordan Love, the Packers quarterback, couldn't help but praise Kraft's return. Tucker looks great, Love said. Since he's been back out there, we've felt his presence. Sure. Kraft's return marks the beginning of what could be a standout season. And, if his training camp performance is any indication, the Packers have found themselves a true weapon in the tight end position. If there's one player who embodies the Packers' new defensive scheme, it's Devontae Wyatt. Known for his ability to penetrate the line and create havoc, Wyatt thrived in a system that encouraged aggression and disruption. Throughout the training camp, he was a constant thorn in the side of the offensive line, consistently breaking through to make plays. Wyatt's performance wasn't just about raw numbers, it was about the timing and impact of his plays. He might not have led the defense in sacks or tackles, but his ability to disrupt plays before they even began set the tone for the rest of the defense. Rashan Gary, a fellow defensive lineman, summed it up best. When he's on his game, no one can block him. That's simple. Nobody. Last season, Wyatt showed flashes of his potential. This year, he seems poised to take the next step. With a focus on sealing the deal on missed opportunities, Wyatt has his sights set on a double-digit sack season. His confidence is palpable, and as he aims for Pro Bowl recognition, Packers' defense looks ready to elevate its game to new heights. Evan Williams may not have been a household name at the start of training camp, but by the end, he had become a player to watch. Selected in the fourth round of this year's draft, Williams entered camp with little fanfare. However, his performance over the past month has been nothing short of extraordinary, making a strong case for a starting role. With five interceptions and a forced fumble during practice, Williams showcased his ball-hawking abilities. His knack for being in the right place at the right time was evident during the joint practice against the Ravens, where he sealed a victory with a crucial interception. Compared to last year's primary starters, who struggled to make an impact, Williams' ability to generate turnovers is a breath of fresh air for the Packers' secondary. Williams' humble yet confident attitude is one of his strongest assets. I definitely feel pretty good, pretty confident about my play, Williams said. As he continues to block out the noise and focus on his development, Packers may have found a gem in the secondary, one who could play a pivotal role in the team's success this season. Zach Tom's training camp journey is a testament to resilience and talent. After recovering from a torn pectoral, Tom's return to the field was eagerly anticipated, and he did not disappoint. 
Before his return, Rashan Gary dominated the right side of the offensive line, exploiting the absence of Tom. But as soon as Tom was back, everything changed. Tom's impact was immediate. From his first snap, it was clear, he hadn't missed a beat. His ability to neutralize elite pass rushers like Gary reminded everyone why he is considered one of the best at his position. Tom's return not only stabilized the offensive line, but also provided a boost of confidence to the entire unit. Tom's greatness lies in his consistency. Even after time away from the field, he was able to perform at a high level without any drop-off. This kind of reliability is rare, and as the Packers gear up for the regular season, Tom's presence will be crucial in protecting Jordan Love and paving the way for the running game. The Packers may have faced challenges during camp, but with Tom back in the fold, the offensive line looks as strong as ever. In a training camp filled with standout performances, Harry Alexander's quiet dominance was easy to overlook. While other players made headlines with big plays, Alexander went about his business with the precision and focus of a seasoned veteran. Opposing quarterbacks, including Jordan Love, were reluctant to test him, for good reason. Alexander's presence on the field has always been a game changer. Last season was a struggle for him, plagued by injuries and inconsistent play. But this year, Alexander seems to have found his groove once again. His ability to lock down receivers and take away one side of the field will be critical for the Packers' defensive success. As Alexander enters his seventh year in the league, he brings a level of maturity and experience that is invaluable to the younger players around him. I have an attitude of gratitude, Alexander said, reflecting on his journey. If he can stay healthy and continue to play at a high level, the Packers' secondary will be one of the toughest units to face in the league. Rashid Walker's ascent during training camp had been nothing short of meteoric. Once seen as a potential backup, Walker has firmly established himself as a key piece of the Packers' offensive line. His performance against some of the NFL's top pass rushers in last year's playoffs was impressive, but his dominance during training camp has solidified his status as a rising star. Walker's ability to shut down elite defenders like Micah Parsons and Nick Boza speaks volumes about his talent and potential. Throughout camp, whether in one-on-one -on -one drills or live situation, Walker performed like a seasoned pro, showing the kind of consistency and poise that coaches dream of. Head coach Matt LaFleur praised Walker's dedication to the process, highlighting his work ethic and attention to detail. I'm excited to see where he goes this year, LaFleur said. With Walker anchoring the left side of the line, the Packers' offensive line looks ready to protect Jordan Love and create opportunities for the running game. As Walker continues to develop, he could become one of the best in the league at his position. Jordan Love's development has been a focal point of this year's training camp to success, and the young quarterback has shown flashes of brilliance that have fans excited for the future. Stepping into the starting role after the departure of Aaron Rodgers, Love faced immense pressure to prove himself, and he has risen to the challenge. Throughout camp, Love displayed improved decision-making, accuracy, and leadership. His connection with receivers, particularly with emerging stars like Tucker Kraft, has been a highlight of practice session. Love's ability to make quick reads and deliver the ball on time has given the Packers' offense a new dimension. But it's not just about the physical aspects of the game. Love's calm demeanor and ability to stay composed under pressure have earned him the respect of his teammate. As the regular season approaches, Love's growth as a leader will be crucial for the Packers' success. If he can carry his training camp form into the season, Packers may have found their next franchise quarterback. The arrival of defensive coordinator Jeff Halfley has brought a new energy to the Packers' defense. Known for his aggressive, Attack-oriented approach, Halfley has implemented a scheme that plays to the strengths of the Packers' defensive personnel. The results have been evident throughout training camp. Halfley's philosophy centers on creating chaos in the backfield, and players like Devontae Wyatt and Rashan Gary thrived in this system. The emphasis on penetration and disruption has led to more tackles for loss and forced turnovers during practice sessions. This aggressive style has also energized the secondary, with players like Evan Williams stepping up to make big plays. 
As the Packers transition into the regular season, Halfley's scheme will be put to the test. If the defense can maintain the intensity and effectiveness they've shown in camp, they could become one of the most feared units in the league. Halfley's ability to get the most out of his players will be key to the Packers' success this season. While much of the focus during training camp has been on the passing game, the Packers' running game has quietly been preparing to make a significant impact. With Aaron Jones and A.J. Dillon leading the charge, Packers boast one of the most formidable backfield duos in the NFL. Jones' explosive playmaking ability and Dillon's bruising running style complement each other perfectly, giving the Packers a dynamic one-two punch. Throughout camp, both backs have looked sharp, showing the kind of burst and vision that can wear down defenses. The offensive line, led by standout performers like Rashid Walker and Zach Tom, has provided solid blocking, allowing the backs to find running lanes. As the regular season approaches, the Packers' the running game will be a critical component of their offensive strategy. The ability to control the clock and grind out tough yards will take pressure off Jordan Love and open up opportunities in the passing game. If Jones and Dylan can stay healthy and maintain their form, the Packers' offense will be a force to be reckoned with. As the Green Bay Packers close the chapter on another training camp, the excitement for the upcoming season is palpable. The performances of players like Tucker Craft, Devontae Wyatt, and Evan Williams have given fans plenty to be optimistic about. The team's blend of young talent and experienced veterans has created a perfect storm of potential. But the real test lies ahead. The regular season will be the proving ground for everything the team has worked on during camp. Can the standouts continue their dominance when the games matter most? Will Jordan Love lead the Packers to new heights, or will the team face challenges as they transition to a new era? One thing is certain. This season promises to be one of the most intriguing in recent memory. As the Packers embark on their journey, fans will be watching closely, eager to see how the story unfolds. So, what do you think? Will the Packers rise to the occasion, or will there be bumps along the way? Share your thoughts in the comments below, hit that like button, and make sure to subscribe for more in-depth Packers news and analysis. The road ahead is filled with possibilities, and we're here to cover every moment of it.